Is the birth of Earth merely a coincidence? And how was Earth gradually shaped step by step? About 4.6 billion years ago, in a corner of the Orion arm of the Milky Way, the eight major planets we know today did not yet exist, only a chaotic primordial nebula. Do you see that twinkling celestial body? That's the primordial Sunday. Still in its infancy, at this moment, it was enveloped by dust and debris, and the scattered fragments around it were essentially remnants from the sun's formation. While drifting in the chaos of the solar system, they continuously collided with one another, then clumped together, growing larger and larger. The force of gravity became increasingly significant. When a certain threshold was reached, these fragments were finally compressed, forming a rocky sphere the primordial Earth. This was the most primitive form of Earth, and one of the eight major planets. According to the giant impact hypothesis proposed by Harvard geologist Reginald Daly in 1946, shortly after Earth's formation, a hypothetical planet named Thea suddenly collided with Earth. Debris from the impact gradually coalesced due to gravity, forming a natural satellite, thus creating the Earth-Moon system we know today. However, Earth at this time was still a barren wasteland, completely devoid of life, and unable to support any form of life. But fortunately, Earth's orbit was perfectly situated within the Goldilocks zona not too hot, not too cold. It was neither too close to the sun to be scorched by its heat, nor too far from the sun to become bitterly cold. Water is the source of life. All creatures, all humans, depend on it to survive in this ideal position. As the early Earth gradually cooled, salt water and fresh water could remain in liquid form, securing a fundamental element for life, and thus, humanity as we know it came to be. Looking at the other seven planets in the solar system, some are too hot, others too cold. So at first glance, though our Earth seems full of coincidences, who would have thought until humans ventured beyond Earth and gained the ability to explore the cosmos, we realize, among the countless stars of the Milky Way, planets with Earth-like coincidences may not be so rare. It's just that those Earth-like planets are hidden in places, light years away, beyond humanity's current reach. Isn't that hard to imagine? In fact, across the entire Milky Way, our Earth is but a speck of dust.